hello everyone welcome to my channel in this video we are going to design and gate using codesys software so where we are uh, in codesys software we, we are designing the ladder diagram for and gate okay before going into the design of ladder gate ladder diagram we need to know about the and gate okay let's see what is about and gate okay so and gate is nothing but it is a basic logic gate and it is a basic building block of uh, all the logic gates and basic building block works as a basic building block in digital electronic circuits that is digital logic design okay so it involves the logical and operation of two boolean inputs which generates one boolean output the boolean expression for and gate is y equal to a dot b so dot operator is working as a and operator in this case in this case a b are the inputs and y is the output so truthable truthable for and gate can be shown like this that is it has inputs a b and it has output y okay so for two bit uh, for two inputs uh, we'll, we are getting four input combinations for the four input combinations we are we are getting corresponding four outputs okay for zero zero output is zero and for only the input combinations of one one the output is one so that's why it is called as and eight one and add with one will get a one so in all other cases the output is zero so logic diagram for the and gate can be shown like this so it has two input lines that is a and b and one output line that is y so let's open let's open let us open the codices ide where we are we were where we are doing uh, doing a ladder design for the corresponding and gate So this is uh, Codesys software. Here you can see there are four input lines: contact, negated contact, parallel contact, parallel negated contact. So these four are can be working as work as a, uh, inputs. That is input lines, and input switches, and coil, set coil, and reset coil. All these three are works as a working as a um, outputs okay so we'll start with the directly start with the design first we have to go to file click on new so it asks for it asks for target settings in target settings we need to choose any one configuration for the target settings so we are choosing the third one here okay so click okay it opens one more window that is name of the uh, new POU that is POU stands for program organization unit in that we are choosing type of POU as program and language of POU as LD. Okay, so now click OK. So one more window pops up. So here you can see the program and here the ladder diagram. Okay, maximize this, drag it down so that you can see the program. Okay, let's start with the Design of AND gate. Okay. So to design AND gate in codices using ladder diagram, we need to have two switches. That is two contacts. Two contacts which acts as a two switches. Okay. In series. So we'll take two switches. That is two contacts in series. Click on the line. So click on 
contact so you get first input that is name it as a1 click in the click on the white space so it, it also pop ups one more window so the, to declare the variable so here we can choose we have to choose vr input type as bool click ok so you can see input a1 that is bool generated here as a, in a program okay so second one you have to take uh, again contact in series click on the line click on the contact you get one more contact in series that is name this as a2 click on the white space choose this also as a VR input click ok so now the input switch is connected and the inputs for the AND gate is over now we have to we have to design the output click on the line click on coil name it as NOT click outside NOT underscore gate or not underscore one choose this as we are output click ok so we, we are done with the design so which has the hand gate which has a1 and a2 as inputs and not underscore one as output now we have to save the file click on save Save it as not gate. Okay, so now it is saved as a not gate one. Okay, so now the ladder design is over for the net and gate. So now we have to compile this design. To compile this design, go to project, click on build. Now it is compiling. See, it should show zero errors, zero warnings all the time when you compile the design. See, zero errors, zero warnings. So there is no error and there is no warning from this large design. Okay, now we have to run this design. Before running this design, we have to we have to make this design. It means we have to put this design into the simulation mode. So to to put this design into the simulation mode, we have to go to online, click on simulation mode. So every time when you when you want to go go and log into the and you want to log into this uh, ladder, any ladder design, we have to put that ladder design into simulation mode we have to check this whether it is ticked or not whether it is clicked or not that is simulation mode so click on it so now it is ticked okay tick mark is done for the simulation modes so that our ladder diagram is in simulation mode now we have to go to online login so the blue line indicates that it shows that our ladder design is entered into the simulation mode and we have to give the input to the switches that is A1 and A2. Okay. Now initial conditions of A1 and A2 are false. Now we have to set it to true or false as per the truth table and to find out the output according to the truth table of and A2. Okay. Now we have to give I will give A1 as one more. Double click on this. See here. Uh, before it was false. Now I am setting it as a true. 
I have not yet set already. Okay, I'm just going it, going to set it as a true. Now we have to go to online and click on write values so that now it is written a one before it was false. Now it is written as true. Okay, so I have clicked on the write values. Now a one is become as true. Now I have to run this file. Okay, online run. So now it is in running mode. Okay, check for the all the four conditions. Now it is for one zero, the output is zero, and for zero zero, double click on this, put online, write values for zero zero, output is zero, for one zero also output is zero as we have seen now, and for zero one, write values. It is already running and for a zero one this is also output is zero. When you check for one one the output is one. So now see output is one. So this completes the design of and gate in codices using two switches that is two contacts which acts as a switches and one coil which acts as a output for and gate. Thank you guys, subscribe to my channel, like my videos, press the bell icon so that you can get the notifications of some other videos which I upload in, into the YouTube channel okay? so that you can they can help you for your further, further work. Okay? Any of the uh, ladder design related videos i will put it into my channel so that you can those can help you for your project works okay thank you